This video will demonstrate the meaning of crossfade in the hit unit. The effect of crossfade is whether there's a blend between animation A and animation B when switching. Here, I'll demonstrate using a character. If the character is created using a skeletal system like 2D animation, when crossfade is enabled, the animation switching looks like this, with a blending process in between. If crossfade is turned off, the animation switches instantly without any blending process in between. The crossfade threshold indicates that the length of the target animation must be greater than this value for the crossfade effect to activate. For example, if I want to switch from stand to crouch, and the length of the crouch animation is 1.33 seconds, and 1.33 seconds is greater than the crossfade threshold of 0.8 seconds, then the crossfade will be effective. If I change the crossfade threshold to 1.5 seconds, now 1.33 seconds is less than 1.5 seconds, so the crossfade won't be effective. That's all for now. I hope this video was helpful to you. Thanks for watching.